They are sending me to you, Baba Tinubu. Now, listen, sir. I have good news for you. Your will is being written. I am what I am by the grace of God. As long as that grace does not fail, Satan will never fail. This revival you see will not be aborted. Let children of God pray. I see fathers in Christ. Please share this message. I see fathers in Christ. They are being substituted. They are being substituted from the throne. I see fathers in faith. They are substituted. They should pray. Let them pray well. Let them pray well. I see fathers in the Lord. As in rock, as in rock, they have been replaced. They have been, re they have been substituted. Fathers in faith. Because God has been going through them to warn them, but I don't know. But this month, this month, I see them being substituted. That's number three. No. Number three, number four, please share this message to so the gospel artists who are wanting one corner. I also see gospel artists. Moria and one corner and me. Think corner and me. Those are not. They are not. They have been singing, the have been singing in the spirit before, but they are not singing in the spirit now. I see them be substituted from the throne of God. I will come out. See, it is not the matter of they say they say. I was. I pray where and where. Father, this thing. You are showing me. Should I come out and say it? Now I see gospel artists. They, it is this started in the They have been substituted. Gospel artists that are on, in the high play, I drop, top. I in the top. They are, they are substituting them now. In this month of August. Uh -huh. So you begin to see it. Some of them they begin to fumble than before. I want me, one mama. I am a real one, was sir. I will never come out and say what they did not. God did not tell me, or what the Spirit of God did not tell me. I am not coming out for fame. I am not coming out that you know me. I am coming out so that they will repent. And if they don't repent, this thing will happen. Uh -huh. Number that is number four. Now number five, please. Thank you, Jesus. Send this message also to the gospel artist. That's number five. They are together. This set of people that they depend on money. Money, they are so pride. This month, I see them that they, they are starting to fade away. Yes, they are beginning to fade away. Those people that rely on money, Emma will see one. You will see their shape. Right, what I'm saying that Emma will see one. Go. Gospel artists that they are so pride, they are pride, and they depend on money. They have privatized themselves. They have monetized the gift of God in their lives. I see that they will fade away. They will fade away. They will fade away. James chapter four verse six. The Bible said he receives the pride. And it brings the humble up. When you read Mark chapter 8, verse 36, what shall profit a man if he gains the whole world and loses his soul to the devil? That's number five. They will fade away if they do not repent. Number six. Beloved, please. I want us to pray against building collapsing. I'll pray against it. It's not my wish for evil to happen. This month, month of August, 
we September, August, October, September, November. October. But it, I see the appearance this month. Mori, we go for you. I see the appearance. Mori, we pay off for our own. So please, let us be careful. If you know the house you are living is not good, go out of that house. Or if you know that house is not okay, go and rectify that house. They are telling you now, please share this program, share this message. I see house collapsing. I have prayed against it. But if you know the house you are living is not okay, Leave the house now. If you know that school, you are using to do school. It's not okay. And you are packing children there. Don't kill them. More. Don't let untimely death fall on them. Leave the house. Parents, be careful. Go and construct the school that your children are going to. August, September, October, November. So December. But I see the appearance in this month. Please, I'm praying it will not happen. Don't say he's saying it now. Because that is how I used to say it's fake. And when it now happens, you now say, Ah, also, also, Emma Dom Moto, don't reach heaven before you know the truth. Oh. That's number six. Number seven, about the administration of Baba Tinubu. Please share this message to him. She cut this place. Cut this place. Share it to him. Of course, the Lord showed me something. I will not say those things. There are some things I don't need to say on here about Baba Tinobu. It's a private thing which I have to pray for him. Because the Bible says it doesn't want. The sinner to, to die and to perish, but to repent. He's calling of repentance. I'm coming out again. They are sending me to you, Baba Tinobu. Now, listen, sir. Please be closer to God. Uh, Baba, I, I don't want, I, I will not say some things because it's, a, it's not what people need to hear. Ha, I want, even if God show me, I have to pray about it. That one is, but this one now, Baba, you did something recently, not so long. Sherry, the Bible said, Ahab sinned against God. And he pleaded for mercy. And God sees him. He tore his clothes. The Bible said, That your punishment. I've, I've, I've given it to your children. The one who knows nothing about it. Now listen. I we be too much in bad luck. When I was praying, when I was praying, the Lord showed me. You Baba Tinubu, you did some Baba Tinubu action, Kaka. Kini e de lagbara. That thing is powerful. Eh, emi o. Kini e lagbara. That thing is powerful. Sir, that thing you did recently. Don't stop it, oh. Eh, mad, eh, mad jaduro. Don't stop it, eh, mad jaduro. That thing you did recently. You know, I said, the bell is upon a fair less The Bible says it doesn't want the death of sinners. As people who know people that they are repentant. I'm not saying this for you to call me, rather for you to know me. No. Whatever I eat, what I will become. God has settled it. Hello? Hi. Yeah, I'm saying this because they sent me to you. So late, only one of now, Five. that you did something recently. Don't stop that thing. That thing is what touched, it touched something in the realm of the spirit. <laughs> now, that is by the way. Under your message, sir. About your administration. The people that want to attack your government, I want to offer to you call Joba. Baba, listen. Baba, go. Let me share this message to him. The Baba. people that want to attack your government, I want to offer to you call Joba. They are around you already. Want to allow you can close that to you. Want to see more. Some of them have started working for you. I want me to share for you. They are working with you. Number one, share for. Why some are are still on the way? 
They are nominating them. Yes, they are already choosing them. Share this message to you. Between now and December, they will start full work. Move close to God. Only Dio. I want to see you. People are suffering. People are suffering. I want to People are suffering. I want to you. Nibi ta wey oru kosi. People where people don't even expect. In kangi di fe ja dembe. Good thing want to come out from there. In kangi di ya kise kufe po lo titi. That good thing won't be that much. La tara babai from this babai. Emi o sokwe bo ya kini o. Me oh, but politician. I no, don't like I don't like any. No, 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 no. Me oh, I don't do with them. I will say what God has shown me. My soul to love him. In Kangi, the conflict that day. But the people working with you, they are already planning something. Why some people are ready to be appointed into your government? They want to work in hand to attack your administration. Under your message. This is the third one. There is somebody, Egbodada. There is somebody you are suspecting. You are suspecting. You are suspecting somebody. In fact, as of yesterday, you still suspect that person. Any that person has got something to do. That person doesn't have income for peace. That is by the way. Now, by Owaku so wo in Baba. It's left to you, Baba. Lati wa se un kanto da. To do what is. Moti suffering the other time. I told you then. This is your night time. In ti eba shele. I shall let you lele. I'm a sonic party. Whatever you do now. Ti eba shere. I'm a sonic party. Instead of you. Bed de shere. I'm a sonic party. Instead of you. That's number seven. Number eight. Hey, hey, please, let me share that program to Baba. Hey, a hey, 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 I want Children of God should pray against it. I'm also, also praying against it. Strength, policy, and law. I want this policy will affect children of God. Pray against it. It's not even one policy. It's not one, no. It's not two. I'm seeing like four. Like four. If not more than, but they have shown me four. Four. Pray against it. Pray in this the administration. In Nigeria. In Nigeria. Pray against strength policy. I'm sure we have all heard everything the prophet of God has said concerning our country, Nigeria. Everything he said will be happening. Everything he said about the gospel artists, the our fathers in faith, and and all the rest, and our. Uh, President Bola Ahmed, will please let us do well to pray for our country Nigeria, especially the house collapse he spoke about. Let us pray that God should avert it in the name of Jesus. We are not going to witness any disaster this year in the name of Jesus. It is important that we pray. It is important that we pray. Let us pray for Bola Ahmed Tinibu. Let us pray for our fathers in faith. Let us pray for our gospel artists. Let us pray for everyone in Nigeria that this year is not good. They are not going to witness or experience any disaster in their life in the name of Jesus. You see, it is important that we pray to God. It is important that we call on to God when we hear uh, prophecies like this. It is not enough to say, okay, let what will happen, happen. Our country, Nigeria, is going through a lot. A lot of people are facing serious challenges in the country. A lot of people are complaining. A lot of people are protesting. A lot of people are crying. If you go online, you see the way people talk. It's nothing even compared to what people are facing outside. People, you know, online, people just uh, talk based on mostly emotions. But if you come out outside to see what people are going through, you will be forced to pray because people are really going through hell in this country. Let us do well to pray that things get better because... I just heard yesterday that uh, somebody was telling me that a cup of rice is now 450 naira. And I was asking the person, what is the reason for this increase? Why are things increasing like this? Why are things like this in the country? They could not give me any answer. 
but i don't know what is going on in the country sometimes i just i wish i can i can i will i will be able to figure out what is actually going on in the country i wish i will be able to figure it out how can one cup of rice something that used to be sold for 50 naira even b before 30 naira is now 450 naira for one cup and the government they are not doing anything about it how will people cope how the rice that they say is even 300 naira be 350 they say that one is the one that contains stone you have to select it and most people are complaining that as you eat the stones are too much it it, it worries their teeth what is going on in this country i don't know what is going on i just i need somebody to help me understand for somebody to explain to me what is actually going on in the country why is there so much hardship in the land and why is nobody doing anything about it why are they are our leaders feeling so reluctant to do what they 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 we are elected they are elected to do why what is going on in the country somebody should please explain to me what is going on are we going to continue like this is it until everybody dies that they will take action what is happening in the land what is happening in the country people are starving and things are getting worse day by day what is happening I don't know what to say because sometimes if you look at the situation of Nigeria, if you think about it like this, it wants to just drive you mad. Because how can a country like Nigeria, a cup of rice be 450 naira? Jesus Christ. How will people cope? How will people live? How will people survive? That is why I always encourage us that we should pray for our country, Nigeria. Some of you may argue that it is not prayer we need. That we will need to go outside and protest. We need to go outside and do this. We need to go outside and do that. But no. I am not saying we should go and do that. Fighting is not going to solve anything. Fighting will not solve anything at all. It will not. It will not. Going out to shout. We have been protesting. It will not solve anything. Because if you have tried. There, there is this saying that, that goes that. This is why saying that goes that insanity is when you continue to do the same thing the same way and expect a different result. We have been protesting and nothing is happening. We have been complaining, nothing is happening. We have done everything, nothing is happening. Why not try prayer? Try prayer. Because if every other thing is not working, it is time for us to turn to God because the way it is going now, it is only God, I believe, that can save us from whatever we are going through in this country, Nigeria. It is only God. And another thing too, we Nigerians, most of us, we are too greedy and selfish. Even when, because I ask, why are they increasing things? It's not like a, a dollar have moved away from the one five it is right now. It is not like a, a fuel price have gone beyond the way it used to be. Why are things increasing here? Why? So it tells you that most of us we are too greedy. If we are just add let's say one naira, we increase. Even when every other thing, transportation is still the same. Even when nothing has changed. People just keep increasing the, the price of their things as if they, they don't care, they don't have conscience. I, it's not fair. It's not fair. Let us do well to go to God in prayer. Let us pray to God for God to intervene, to touch the heart of all these people, the, the people that says the politicians out there. Because at this point, we are not praying only for the leaders of this country. We are also praying for the citizens of this country because most of us, we are super greedy. Most of us, I don't know, I don't know the right adjective to use in qualifying the, our level of greed in this country. The level of greed that most of us, we, we, we express. We are too greedy and selfish. As long as we make money, we think that, okay, it is business. I will make all the No. You can't be making money while other people are go at the expense of other people, while other people are suffering. What is not the difference between you and the politician? It is not everything we accuse the politicians. Some of us, we are guilty of everything we are accusing these politicians of. If they are big thieves, we are smaller thieves. In fact, we are even bigger thieves. It's, it's not fair it's not nice we must we must try and do the right thing at all time we must not say uh, this that that no 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 let us do the right thing at all times let us do the right thing we cannot continue like this and be suffering people please 
it's important that we do that thank you so much for watching the video please do have to subscribe to the channel turn on your notification bell so whenever i post another video you'll be notified don't forget like the video and drop a comment by doing this you trigger the youtube algorithm to continue to recommend and share the video to more people god bless you as you do so i'll see you in the next one you are blessed i have good news for you your will is be written i am what i am by the grace of god as long as that grace does not fail Never. This revival you see will not be aborted.